Hello there everybody, welcome to episode 10 of I Play Skyrim. Uh, right here in this game, we are going to go to Solitude. One of the major cities, I think it's one of the biggest cities, if not the biggest city, in the whole of Skyrim. And we need to meet Malborn there. So, um, the best way to get there from Riverwood is to get as close as possible so we don't waste a lot of time. So let's go to Euston Graph where we were before. Hopefully the bandits there have not respawned. Okay, here we are at Euston Graph. So we need to go in this direction. So let's just run. I heard something there. I heard an arrow. Who's shooting at me? A couple of red dots. Who is that? They could be mud crabs. And that could have been Lydia trying to. Oh, they're slaughter fish. Oh, they're not worth bothering about. Let's just carry on. Okay, right here we are in solitude. It's important to note the first time you ever go to solitude, you'll witness an execution of a man who uh, was uh, loyal to the Stormcloaks. I don't think there's anything that you can do about it. I tried before to try and stop it, but it just caused me to be in trouble and get hurt. Um, so, or get, you know, be able to have to spend time in jail or whatever. If you're not interested, oh, right then. well, let's just leave that leave that to it because there's nothing I can do about it. We need to meet Malborn in the Winking Skeva. This uh, quest is happens to be my favourite quest in the whole game. Um, it's one that you have to do quite early on, but I absolutely love it. And I've died so many times before, so probably today will be the first, the first time I actually die in this whole run. Yes. Hello, mm. Melbourne. Our mutual friend sent me. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she does. Quite what rude, doing. aren't you? Here's the deal. Hmm. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Right, so I've got to give him everything that I need while I'm there. What kind of, uh, I'm not going to ask what I need, because I know what I need. So, I'm ready. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Right, I'm just going to give everything to him, so... Okay, so he's got everything and I'm naked! <laughs> but there's a good reason for it and you'll see. There's a good reason for that when we see Delphine outside. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. Yes, I'll yes, you. Yeah, yeah. Well, I've got that down. Let's just go. Your job is to get into the party. Yes, you keep saying, shut spot. up. I'll take care of the rest. Ooh, butterflies. But anyway, let's carry on. We need to meet La Delphine. She's very close. She's probably around the stables. Okay, there you are. 
Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into yes. the embassy? Yes. Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Okay. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Yeah. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. Okay. You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed... I know that. You haven't given me any chance whatsoever to put the clothes on. That. All right. Okay. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the Embassy? Yes, I am, and I don't think Lydia's going to be able to come with me. I'm ready. Get the rest of my things safe for me. Yeah. Don't worry. It will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, talk to Melbourne. He's ah, up there. But... Fellow latecomer to Ellen's little soiree. Mm -hmm. There should be somebody at the door. Shows. Salute ready for me lady. to give my invite to so my lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this god's forsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late ah okay please you first I insist welcome to the Thalmor embassy your invitation please here you go even though you're walking away from me go right in did i throw it at you or something now then here's my invitation <clears throat> okay. The Thalmor Embassy. Welcome. This sounds uh, like a very, very good party. Okay, here we are. And who's this? Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor ambassador to Skyrim. Okay, okay. Let's see. What do I say? Do I introduce myself? Ask where I get a drink. Flatter. I think we're going for flattery. Have you? All good, I trust. But you have me at a disadvantage. I'm afraid I know nothing about you. Please, tell me more about yourself. What brings you to this... to Skyrim? Mm, take it you don't like Skyrim. It's just that we have run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. Red. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Okay. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please enjoy yourself. I will do. So, let's speak to Malbourne then. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you distract the guards, I'll open this door and we can get you on your way. Okay. Let's hope we both live through this day. Yes, me too. Yes, I'd like a drink. Here you go, ma'am. The finest Colovian brandy. Well, is where is it? else I can get for you? This game would be a lot more impressive if they actually mm, showed the action of giving friend. the drink and her holding the drink or drinking the drink even. But it doesn't. But anyway, how can I distract everybody? I think I'll talk to the guy I was talking to outside. Mm, what does a fellow to need to do to get a drink around here? Once again, here, I bought you a drink. Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles. <laughs> if there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Well, now you mention it. Uh, actually, there is something you can do for me. Wonderful. I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. I need you to cause a scene, get everyone's attention for a few minutes. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork. <laughs> okay. So he's gonna go over there. Attention, everyone. Get everyone's attention. attention. And I've gotta go behind here now. and meet Malborn. Yes, what do you need? I need to talk. Let's go. Let's go. Before anyone notices us. Okay. Let's go. Before anyone notices us. Alright, you'd have to repeat yourself. Okay. So my stuff's in that room next door. I'm gonna wait for him to open it because I don't have the so keys. So far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. 
We need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Yes, of course. Me. Who comes, Malburn? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave strange smells? Rest. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Savani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Okay. Your gear is in that chest. Yeah. I'll lock the door behind you. Okay, Don't thank screw you. this up. Right. Let's... Uh, yeah. Take all. Equip what we need to equip. Uh, yeah, that, that, get rid of that. Uh, that, 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 and weapons. Probably best to carry on with these steel arrows. That, where's the bow? Right, okay. Anything more you have to say? Read up. I've got to get back before I'm missed. Okay, well I'll come through here then. I think I'll sneak through. I'm not going to first person, but I'll sneak through. Good Did luck. you see those robes? You're on your own this morning. Yeah. Who are they with? More of the emissaries' treaty enforcers? Right. Whoever it is behind this door, I'm going to have to take them out. So I am going to equip no, my bow. They're high mages, just in from Alinor. I guess myself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. If a dragon does show up, maybe we'll get lucky and it will eat the mage's food. Over here! Might give us enough time. Oh! I'm staying out of here. Oh! Uh, let's get using the arrows. What's the best you can do? Is the only truth. You are but a dog, and I am your. Yeah, 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 right. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to um, take something or a few things, and I'm gonna equip my war hammer now. This is more of a war hammer moment. Come on. Come out and face me. Oh. Wah! Got him. Got him, got him, got him. I'm so pleased about that. I was so worried that I'd end up dying. Right, let's uh, see if these guys have got anything on them that I need and that I can take and take the arrow back. But I think they're... Um, their armor or equipment is anything that I really can use. Let's look around, see what I can take. Yes, we need to get on with the uh, with the task, but you know, won't hurt to look around. Mm. Oh, I don't really like searching barrels. There's never anything in there that I need. Uh, hood of no. Uh, anything in here? Whoops! Side of the door. Do you need any food? No. Right, I'm just gonna have a little search upstairs. Right, so well, there could be stuff around here that I could really make use of. Oh, is that a skills book? No. Nah, I'm not gonna bother looking around for loads of books. See if there's any more like potions or anything else. Regeneration, strength. What kind of herbs? But I've got I've got loads of herbs as it is. Oh, these might be full of stuff. There's minor healing. I don't need any magicka, but uh, it's always worth taking some if you need it. But at the same time, I've got like ten vials of magicka. And do you know what? I've never used them. I had well, I hardly ever use them. I don't need stamina. Poison. Ooh. That's 
some nice stuff in here. No, we don't want to go back down to Skyrim. Let's just get back to what we were doing. Okay. Right. This is where we need to go. Anything else that we can take? don't think so. Well, let's go. I think I need to be very careful here, so I'm going to sneak and use my uh, bow. I'm going to do a save here as well, just in case. I have a feeling this may well be the first time I actually die. Stay over there. If you are, great, because then I can just hit you. Just one more hit, and you're gone. I think that one's going to come around here for me, so I'm just going to sit back here, let my uh, health go up a bit. Are you going to come around or are you going to stay there? some more over there. Tell you what I'm gonna do while I'm here. A little bit do a little bit of magic, I think so. Let's heal. Will you now? They're on the other side of the door. Think. Well, anyway. Let's see, gold. Oh, they've got steel arrows as well. I'm going to take those. Or are they fighting each other? Or something's going on over there. I don't know what's going on. Oh, where was this wizard that I uh, floored? see who they are, where they are. Um, oh well, I think it's best that I just get on with getting through here. And I'm so pleased I didn't die. <laughs> My uh, weapon equipped. Just stand still. No, I will not. Oh, 
Oh, I need to drink some potions. Otherwise, I'm going to die. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yes. All right, I'm almost dead, but not quite. I almost died, but I didn't. So I'm pleased about that. Oh, what's this? Uh, that's the same cake in the diamond that I saw upstairs. Do I need anything more? Uh, no, I think we're fine. What else should be on the mend in a bit? Interrogation chamber, yeah. Scroll, scroll. Flame atronarch. Oh, very handy. Uh, I will take that one. Munch yeah, I can destroy that on an arcane enchanter and uh, level up. Let's have another look around, see if there's anything else I can take that I need or that I can just use. Food is always a good way to restore your health if you don't have a lot of potions. But in order to restore your health, you need to eat a feast. You need to carry a lot of stuff, and sometimes it's just not practical to carry loads of stuff. I'll take that. Frostbite then? There's lots of stuff here I can use for alchemy, but at the moment alchemy is not top of my agenda. So, uh huh, there's the chest I need to look at. Right, let's have a look. Anticipate a breakthrough in our efforts to uncover the part or power behind the dragon resurrection phenomenon. An informant has identified a possible lead whom we have brought back to the embassy for full interrogation. The subject is obstinate, but by all indications is holding back for the information we seek. I have authorised immediate manual uncoiling. I do not expect more will be necessary unless you feel time presses. I know you prefer to be present for the final questioning. I will inform you immediately when the subject is fully receptive. Two days should tell the tale. In the meantime, if you wish to audit our technique, your expertise is welcome as always. I have placed the prisoner in the cell closest to you up the stairs for your convenience. Relindil, third M. And Relindil is one that we just kill. We need to take that. Um, I've already got one of those keys. I'll take Delphine's dossier. Yeah. And Ulfric's dossier. Okay. I think there's anything more of the shelves that we can take. Um, okay, what's down there? I'm very weary about this. There might be things down there that we need to be careful of. So, always up down here. Anything in here? I'm going into first person mode just so I can sneak a lot more confidently. I always find sneaking in, is always better done in first person. To close. So, right. Okay, well, it looks like we're in the torture chamber. I would imagine that there are guards about, so I'm glad that we're in this position. But I do want to put my bow and have it at the ready just in case. I want to have a look over. Shoot that person from up here. I'm gonna save while I'm here. Yeah, I can hear the torture victim. That's them trussed up in. I'm just gonna sneak around the corner slowly. Thank you very much. I'm still hidden, that's a good sign. So I love this quest because you get to not just be a, a warrior or vigilante, you get to be a spy. Someone's seen me, I think. Still says I'm hidden, but there's a red dot. It's gone. Alright, 
mate. I'll be there in a minute. Um. Do I wish what? No. Alright, I'm gonna come out of this now. I'm so pleased that, that I passed that again and that I leveled up. Okay. I think a bit of health will come in handy here. I think that person is not the only um, Thalmor I'm gonna come up against down here. So let's see what else we can increase. Uh, archery? Oh, eagle eye. Oh, I love doing this. I love being able to zoom in. I'll take eagle eye. Else? I will come to you in a minute, mate. Uh -huh. Esburn. Search for information about dragons returning. Escape the Thalmor Embassy. Oh, there are more people. I can hear them. I'm going to save here. I don't want to lose the progress. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender immediately, or you both die. Never mind. Silence, I'll never have come here. Move slowly. I told you. It's Malborn. I don't know anything else about it. Not here what? to torture you. Who? What? What do you want then? Come on, free him. Yeah. Get him out of there. Sure. Oh, okay. someone is attacking me! Quickly! This way. I've seen the guards use it to get Will you? Oh, please, potions, 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 more potions. Not too many. There we are. Any more around? I don't think I can hear any more. Let's get the trapdoor key. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Then we another trapdoor key. All right, Melbourne. Were they? Oh, there he is. Oh. You poor sod. Oh, well, I'll take a few things from you anyway. Thank you very much for that. And Ray. You've been incredibly helpful. Thank you, Malborn. Let's see what was up here. If there is anything on up here. Yeah, I can always take some more healing. I don't know what this place is. Just a cupboard or I don't know. Did we come through here? I don't think we did. It's a chest though. It's another place of discovery. Uh-huh. Okay, well I'm going to try and open this, it'll help get my lockpicking up. Might be worth though, because I don't have a lot of lockpicks. If I put on the... Put that on. 
Lock picking should be easier. Yes, did it. Excellent. Shall I take daggers? Uh, shall I take... It's not letting me collect... Oh, it's a circlet. could always do a bit more haggling. Can't search that. What's that though? Lots of paper. I don't really need paper. Um, all right. So. Oh, this is where we. This is where we came in. Okay. So. We've already been through there. Let's go back through to the dungeon. And then I think we need to find a trap door. Shoot that. Uh, let's look at inside any of these or anything in there that we can take. Or anything we need in there. Nope. There's a chest here though. Yeah, more lockpicks. Always good for lockpicks. Don't need another one of those helmets. Okay, unlock. Let's go through here then. Oh, lovely. Yeah, might as well. Follow this guy, he seems to know where he's going. Oh! Oh, don't tell me he died! Oh, he died! Oh god, I don't think I stand a chance against this frost troll. Not at all. Ah! How do I get out? Ugh. I don't know. How do I get out? Oh, I died. Oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> the first time I died. Oh, no. Oh, we're here. So let's, uh... Uh, yeah, I'm going to try and follow you as well, mate. Oh, I need to go back in there at some point because I, I saw a gem and some bits and pieces that I need to do. But I, I can only do it if I, ca if I kill that troll. And I think on my own, at the level I'm at the moment, I'm not really able to do that. So I need to go back to the embassy at some point. Okay, so, we've done this, I just need to talk to Alphine. You didn't have to help me, so, thanks. You are welcome. Now, I want to go up in this direction, because there is a, a standing stone not far from here, which is a really, really good stone. Brilliant one to have on. Um, I can't quite remember the way to it. So I'm going to have to wing it a little bit. Lydia! Where did you come from? Hey girl, thanks very much. Oh! No, that's not more than... better than what I'm wearing, using at the moment. Right, gotcha, gotcha. Another bandit. You'll meet so many bandits along here. Bandit chiefs are always hardest to kill, but they are the most. They have the best equipment that you can steal or whatever. So let's just first of all see if there's anything here worth looting. Um, ebook and pickpocket. Okay. Excellent. And a chest, which I need to unlock. Uh -huh. 
Yeah, I can destroy that as well. And get some uh, things going with the arcane enchanter. Anyway, my main objective is to get to that stone up there. The Steed Stone. This is a brilliant stone because you can get now an extra hundred capacity. Extra hundred, hundred capacity, that's brilliant. I love it. Right here, that's all we need. So, Lydia, where are you, dear? It's probably stuck somewhere, there we go. Anyway, let's just get back to Delphine and finish this whole shiz off. Uh, where is she? She's probably back in, yeah, she's back in Riverwood. Okay, here we are. Oh, who's this? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. All right. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Mm-hmm. Looks like that's it. Got to go. The Yarl. Which Yarl? I would I would assume it's the White Run Yarl, but let's have a look. Uh so letter from Yarl. Oh no, a different Yarl. I have the honor uh, I've the honor to be the Yarl and the proud ancient city of Falkreath. We haven't been there yet. The fame of your exploits across the Skyrim has brought to you to my attention. If you are interested in becoming a Thane of Falkreath, yes I am. I invite you to speak to me the next time you're in Falkreath. Aside from the honour that accrues to the title, my thanes are entitled to a personal house carl. Oh, a bit like Lydia. I can also tell you privately that a choice parcel of land in Falkreath would be available for your purchase should, uh, purchase should your services prove useful to me. I look forward to meeting you in person. So that's absolutely fantastic, and the fact that there is a bit of land where I can build a house, that is part of the Hearthfire uh, DLC. You want to talk to me after everything you've done? No. I didn't talk to you, I didn't say anything to you, you just assumed. Right, where are you? Oh, you're down in your little den, aren't you? Confused by these things. You made it out alive, at least. Your gear is safe in my room, as promised. Okay. Did you learn anything useful? Uh, the foul will know nothing about the dragons. Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that? They're trying to investigate it too, I think. Uh, yes, I'm sure. They were looking for someone called Esbern. Esbern? He's alive? I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. That crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's going on with the dragons. What else would the Thalmor want with the... With Esbern. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. Hmm. So the Thalmor think the blades know about the dragons? Ironic, right? The old enemies assume that every calamity must be a plot by the other side. Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. Mm -hmm. He'll know how to stop the dragons if anybody does. Okay. Do they know where he is? They seem to think he's hiding out in Riften. Riften, eh? Probably down in the Ratway, then. It's where I'd go. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjolf. He's well-connected. A good starting point, at least. Oh. And when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Okay. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. You'll know what it means. Alright. 
Uh, let's see. I don't want to know anything more about the blades. Uh, a cornered rat. That's going to be our next uh, place. So we need to go to Riften. Okay, so I've decided to go back to uh, White Run for the time being. Uh, reason being for that is because I want to sell some stuff, and uh, yeah, that there I believe is the house that I may one day purchase. But I'm going to do my selling and uh, buying of stuff off camera because otherwise it'll be quite boring. What do you need? I'll go away. So for the time being I would say goodbye, thank you very much for watching, please uh, let me know what you think, I haven't had much in the way of feedback, uh, so I would appreciate it if you could let me know what you think, and if you want to stick with me and know whenever I'm uploading a new one, because it's going to be a long term thing, then please subscribe and make sure you click the bell icon, I think that's something that hasn't been out very long. And it will just let you know whenever there's a new one up. And hopefully there'll be a walkthrough or something that might help you. Or you may have something that you think might help me. Uh, so thank you very, very much. And goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.